Hey, what's up? Jigs are here. Are you looking for a specific directory in your call logs? Or have you cleared your history and forgotten to save an important contact information? In this video, I will recommend the two best methods to recover deleted call history on your iPhone. Let's go. There are two ways to recover your deleted call history, either directly on your iPhone or on a computer. Both methods only work if you created an iCloud or iTunes backup before deleting your calls. If you have not created a backup, skip directly to the Use Third-Party Software timestamp. To check if your device is backed up to iCloud, open Settings, tap your name, and go to iCloud. Navigate to iCloud Backup, select a copy, and see the date it was created. If you want to restore from your iCloud Backup because you deleted the call afterwards, you must completely reset your device and go through the initial setup again. On the other hand, if you restore from your computer, you will need either the Finder application if you're on a Mac, or iTunes for Windows users. Once either app is launched, connect your iPhone to your computer using an original or MFI certified cable to ensure that data can be transferred. Then click the Trust button and enter the device passcode to complete the connection. Next, refer to the Backup section. Choose the specific storage where your backup is stored and click Restore Backup. Select the backup version you want to restore to and follow the on-screen instructions to complete the process. Upon reboot, your iPhone should be restored to the backup version you selected, along with the call logs you need. While having a backup in iCloud or on your computer is an advantage, the downside is that you have to completely reset your device to restore the data you need. If you're looking for a way to selectively restore your phone records without affecting the rest of your data, you definitely need a specialized tool. For this, I recommend iMyPhone DBAC. Click on the tag in the upper right corner for your reference. The download link is also provided in the description box below. DBAC is a tool specifically designed to allow you to recover a variety of file types, including deleted photos and videos, WhatsApp attachments, messages, and many others, even without a backup. This software is available both on Windows and Mac. Choose the appropriate OS before clicking the download button to try it out. Although the software has a paid version, scanning your iPhone for recoverable data is completely free, so you can check if the data you need is still on your iPhone without paying for the software yet. Upon downloading, follow the on-screen instructions to install DBAC on your computer. After installation, connect your iPhone to your computer using an original or MFI certified cable. On your iPhone, enter your device passcode when prompted and click Trust to confirm the connection. From the DBAC dashboard, choose iPhone Recovery from the top menu and click Next to proceed. As you can see, DBAC offers different data types that you can recover from your iPhone. But for now, let's stick to the Messages and Call Log section. Next, make sure that Select All is unchecked. Otherwise, the program will take longer to scan, especially if you have a lot of data on your device. To recover all deleted call records from your device, click to select Call History. After selecting the app from which you want to recover data, click the Scan button and confirm by entering your device passcode. During the scan, the program may ask you to re-enter your device passcode several times, so be sure to keep your iPhone connected and unlocked, and enter the passcode as needed. Once the process is complete, DBAC automatically provides a preview window showing all the recovered data. Open the Call History panel from the sidebar menu to view all the call records that the software has recovered from your device. Mark each data as checked if you want to restore it. When everything you need is selected, click either Restore to Device to restore the data directly to your iPhone, or click Recover to Computer to export the recovered data to an external file. As I've mentioned earlier, the DBAC free trial is limited to scanning your data. To proceed with the recovery, a subscription is required. 
After selecting your preferred restore location, click the Next button to continue. If Find My is currently activated on your device, you will be prompted to turn it off. Open Settings. Tap your name above and go to the Find My configuration page. Proceed to Find My iPhone, toggle it off, and enter your Apple ID password to confirm your changes. Then follow the additional on-screen instructions from DBAC to complete the recovery process. When finished, your selected data should be restored to your device or computer, depending on which mode you selected earlier. If the process is unsuccessful, this indicates that your files have been deleted permanently, making any recovery attempts impossible at this point. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.